It's the greatest show in the world. I, Donald John Trump, the office of President of the United States. Did you yeah. vote for him? I did not vote. I've never voted. How could you not vote? How could I be the only person out there that has never voted? This is why the country is in chaos like it is right now. But I don't want my kids to be exposed. How old are your kids? They're around like seven or eight. And you let them watch TV? No, I don't, actually. You, you don't watch I don't any. have time to watch TV. Okay, Madonna. Well, it's true. <laughs> Get over it. You're angry. Well, there you go. All right, on a different topic. Okay, <laughs> just to get no. I think I got something going yeah, here. Yeah, you're, you're really doing good. <laughs> you're getting on a good side. Hi, this is Madonna, and you're listening to Hollywood. Can you do it again and act like you know me, like you really like me? <laughs> Hi, this is Madonna, and you're listening to Hollywood, who is absolutely gorgeous, and it is too good to be missed. Mm. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about, baby. <laughs> Frankie Hollywood Rodriguez. <laughs> don't think, it. I don't even think Hollywood's his real middle name. Frankie Hollywood Rodriguez. 9 FM, we play anything. It's Frankie Hollywood Rodriguez. I have to get a Valentine's Day gift today. Do you ever buy those flowers at the gas station? Like when you're coming home late at night, you're supposed to be home about 9, 10 at night. And it's like 6 in the morning, you know, just a couple hours late. You pay for your gas and you look over and there's always that rose and that little glass tube. Don't ever bring one of those home. You are hysterical. At least you can laugh at your own impending doom. Hi, I'm Cindy Crawford, and you're listening to Frankie. So what do you do if you got, like, a big zit on your forehead? The ability to cover up a zit has a lot more to do with the zit than your ability. Because if you have, like, a huge honker, I mean, it's there. It's, it's not going anywhere, and you just have to kind of get over it. Let's go to Tom in Arlington Heights. Would you ever get your wife plastic surgery for a Valentine's Day gift? Be honest. <laughs> no. 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 How do you give that gift to your wife? I don't know. Wait, wait. <laughs> I'm not making this up. 30% off of blessing surgery. <laughs> Listen, I love you, but please, go see this guy. <laughs> I got to straighten out. This is ridiculous. Right. That's what you said last week. Well, you know, you know. How much can you straighten out in one week? It's Frankie in the morning. The best pickup line you heard. Is that a keg in your back pocket? Because I sure would like to tap that ass. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's a good one right there. Holla at your boy, Frankie. Can you whistle like no, that with no, your fingers? No, Do that. How do you do that? I don't know. I can't do it. My dad can do it. I can't do it. When you learned how to whistle, did you walk around and like whistle all the yes. time? And so when you learned how to snap your snap finger, my finger yeah, can you snap the with the other hand? Yeah. I can't snap with both hands. No. What finger do you snap with? The this third? One. <laughs> Peter right here. See one hundred five point three. Hey, this is Cheech Marine. Listen to my man, Frankie Rodriguez. Lawrence is here. Lawrence is a little Frenchy. Hi, everybody. Parlez-vous français? Oui, je parle français. Et toi, parlez-vous oui. français? So why do they like Jerry Lewis in France? Because they like movies about him. He's quite fun guy. I mean, he's like your Marlon Brando out there. He's, yeah, he's actually, insane. He could have been in The he Godfather. Could, he could have been The Godfather. Oh, Mr. Corleone! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> if anything could happen to my son while he's overseas, I'm going to blame some of the people in this room. Oh! Hey, it's Gary Delabate, Baba Booey. Listen to Frankie, or he'll break your legs. Frankie, the guy whose home movies look like the Sopranos. Jamie's running the board here. Jamie does a phenomenal job. And like five guys have asked me already, what does that Jamie look like, man? Oh, no. <laughs> I'll tell her I'm getting out in like two months. I'm going to get paroled and... Uh... Oh, no. That's the guy who's interested in me? Yeah. That's not bad. That's not bad. There's nothing wrong with that. He's guaranteed to be good for at least three months. See? You well, go. you just make the phone call. <laughs> there you go. Tyrone is acting up. <laughs> Hello, this is Charlie Sheen. Tough being you. It's a full-time job, you know. It's <laughs> coming up in the ranks. It's going to take the title away from you. That, that's the problem. I mean, I'm, I'll, I'll, I'll groom somebody. Frankie, it's the greatest show in the world. You think girls go to the movies because they think Johnny Depp's a great actor? Or the Twilight guy? Oh, I don't. They don't. They don't go. Oh. They don't care. All right, my bad. Look at the teeth on that guy. <laughs> What do you want? They got exactly. Hi, it's me, Dave, and you're listening to that guy, Frankie Hollywood Rodriguez. Yeah. Is that it? Are we done? Yeah. All right. <laughs> My mom and dad never, they never slept together. Ever. I don't know how we... <laughs> No, my mom and dad were one of those parents that hated each other. They always hated each other. Did your parents like Kiss and stuff? Kiss was my first concert. No, I didn't say if you went and saw Kiss. Like, stop ah, it! I, I'm asking. Did they like Kiss? 
<laughs> God, my parents never showed affection, ever. When they got divorced, we were all like, thank God. It's over. <laughs> so who did yeah, you I mean, stay I'm, with, though? I didn't stay with anybody. I was 50. No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was real rough. Who I tell you, it was a rough divorce. <laughs> No, I, this is very awkward because I know my dad listens to everything I say. I am your father. My mom's like my best friend in the whole world. I just feel weird talking about it. Like, my dad's not, like, really a dad, you know? Yeah. My dad's like the guy. Yeah, oh, yeah. He's the guy, you know He's what I mean? He's not your dad. Hey, 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 how you doing? Yeah, yeah, right. yeah. My sister needs a heart transplant. All right, well, <laughs> let me know what's going on. Let me know how that works out. Yeah, yeah all right. Well, I got to go to work. Call me tomorrow. <laughs> you know what I mean? That's my dad, the guy. Right? Bye-bye. Hi, I'm Jerry Springer, and, uh... Frank is even too weird for my show. Frankie Rodriguez, listen to him all the time when I drink. What's the matter with you people? I was joking! Don't you know a joke when you hear one? <laughs>